Hello, my name is Sara and I grow medicinal plants. We like to explain the people of the properties that the medicinal plants uh, have and how you can use it for your health and how you can have your own pharmacy at home with different plants for different travels. So if you want, I'm going to show you my plants. This is the stevia. It's one of the most popular plants that we grow. This is sweet. And now the big companies like Coca-Cola are using this plant, but not the medicinal plant, only the sweetness of this plant. And um, this is for uh, diabetes and for your sugar, to regulate your, the sugar in your blood. And for high pressure of the blood, and it's for, you can sweetener the tea or things like this. This is to, for regulate your cholesterol as well. This plant is Calanchoe daigremontiana. There are a lot of plants in this family, but only three of them, you can eat them and they have uh, properties, medicinal properties. Uh, this is uh, for uh, people with cancer, you eat it like this and it's for uh, make it stronger your immune system. These plants are Melissa and Hierba Luisa. Uh, the properties are really similar. They are for a digestive system, for the stomach ache and uh, to relax, to sleep better. This plant is called Celedonia and you can use it for the cateries in the eyes. You just have to cut the plant and you find the um, orange liquid, you put it in the uh, with the eye closed, you put it like this, or if you have moles, it eliminates. So uh, you do the same, you cut a little bit of the plant, and with the orange liquid, you put it in your skin, and that's it. This plant is called uh, Artemisa annua, and uh, you can use it to kill bacteria, like uh, malaria or uh, Ebola or Leishmania. The name of this plant is Galio and you can use it for uh, regulate your hormonal system. This plant is Epilobium and uh, this plant reduces the inflammation of prostate. This is only a small part of what we do. If you want some advice or more information, you can visit our website www.tujardinmedicinal.com.